Guys, so this is how I want you to um, some access and submit the assignment. So I'm going to copy that link. Um, so I'm going to give you this particular link right here. And it should take you right into GitHub. I'm in incognito mode here, so um, I'm not in my account yet. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in to an account. One of the many seemingly endless accounts I have in GitHub. Not the right password. There we go. Or not. Try this again. So I want you to take that URL I'm going to give you and see if this works. And you're going to paste it into a browser and you're going to try very hard to sign in oh i hate it when it does that and then you're going to be annoyed um i'm going to pause this while i'm annoyed okay i'm in so i'm in a separate github account um you can see i'm an incognito because it's got the dark theme it says incognito so <clears throat> this would be at the point that you're at you just copy the url into your github you're signed in you don't need to be an incognito but you're signed in so my recommendation, because you're going to be using all of these files, is to download it. And I don't think you can download an individual folder in GitHub. I think you have to download all of this. Make sure I'm right here. Yeah. So my recommendation is to download it. If you're familiar with cloning, if you'd rather do clone, that's fine. But download zip is probably going to be the easiest way right now without going into a desktop or anything else. And trying to make this as least confusing as possible um, right now. So download zip. I think everybody's pretty familiar with um, zip drives. It downloads it as a zip drive. And then what you can do is show in folder. That may happen today. Show in folder. All right. So you can see I've done this a few times. Um, so we're going to extract it, hit extract, and we're going to hit browse. So what my recommendation to you is to go to wherever you're housing all your JavaScript 2 class files and make a folder called week 4. Um, make a folder for um, GitHub download as of... 11 2020 which is today's date yours may be different um, but just to kind of give you some idea of what where your download is and then you would select this folder and this is where you're going to extract all the files to so again this is JavaScript 2 week 4 github download as of the date it extract because it's easy when you have multiple downloads and the file names are all the same and it's a whole mess and mine's messy as you can tell um that's probably why my computer keeps crashing and i just haven't had the time or the patience to deal with it but anyways and so what you'll be able to find is eventually desktop javascript 2 week 4 and this is a GitHub download as of 4.11.2020. And you'll see all of this. And then what we're going into is week four. And these are the files that you'll be needing. The empty thing is something, you can delete that. You don't need it. It's an empty file. Whenever you create a folder in GitHub, you can't create an empty folder. So to create a folder, I have to put an empty file in it. 
don't worry about it. But you can ignore that empty thing um, and delete it if you want. The, so we got the three image files that I promised you. Have the shoes. I know athletics women is shoes misspelled. I don't care because that's how it is in the code. I'm going to leave it alone. And we got our style file, our CSS file, our jQuery file, our index.html. So what you would need to do is to go ahead and um, right click on one of them. I'm going to go and start with the HTML, right click, open with, VS Code. And there's multiple ways that you can access it from here. Um, you don't have to do it this way. And make sure I'm in the right thing. There we go. Actually, I'm going to close this, close out my folder. So if you had some stuff that you were working on, instead of getting mixed up, I want to go ahead and close it and make sure I have a clean slate. And then, you know, nothing else is going on. No other files are open. Open folder. Uh, go to JavaScript 2. For me, week 4. GitHub downloads. Spring. Yeah, that. And we'll go ahead and select folder. So your file structure and organization may be different, but that's how mine is. This will just kind of help give you a, a cleaner place to start as opposed to all of those other files and folders in there. So you can click on index.html. Um, so some of the things that you will need to do, like provide the image file. Um, my recommendation would be to go ahead and I don't have a folder in here named images is um, go ahead and create a folder named images. Then you can click on one, hit control button. This is again my PC. Click on another one and click on another one. And you can drag them into images folder. Yes, we want to move them. Maybe. It's just being slow. I don't know if I need to do an update on here or not. But that's what you would do. It's going to crash on me here in a second. Um, but just to get your your slate clean whenever you get started on here. So while that's going to get right around me, what you would do after you make those edits per the assignment requirements, you would, I'm in the, um, the student version of what you guys are accessing, and you would go ahead and upload them. You would upload them into your own little GitHub in whatever kind of format you have. And because right now I'm still in the the parent one. Um, so you would upload it into GitHub the way you've been doing it. And then you would send me that link. OK, let's see. So let's go ahead and go to my repositories. And it's thinking. I have a very thoughtful computer. Sometimes it takes too long to think, though. Um, pause this while it's thinking. And it's done thinking. Okay, so I hit play and go back in here. So I've already forked the repo. You guys should have already maybe have forked the repo as well. Somewhere you need just like a repo of this stuff for JavaScript class. And what you can do. After you access that repo, maybe. And you make those edits to those files per the assignments. And this is stuff you've already been doing before. The uploading of files. It's still thinking, it's still thinking. So instead of finding that pause button again, I'm just going to let it go and you can just fast forward this part in the video. There we go. Okay. So you would just click on Upload Files. Um, if you want to mm -hmm. 
actually this because there's so many dependencies let's do it this way because there are dependencies with the javascript and the css what i want you to do is this um, create new file and you're going to create your own folder so the way you create a folder is jquery i want you to name it jquery assignment And then you do the forward slash and what this is going to do is automatically create another file for you to do and this is why you see empty on those sometimes because it won't allow you to create a folder with that there's no files in it so what you will need to do to mimic me type in jquery assignment for the name of the folder type in the word empty you want to commit new file don't have to worry about anything else just commit the new file Okay, so if you go back into here, you'll see there's a jQuery of assignment folder. So you click on that. And this, like I said, because there are f files with dependencies, this is where I want you to do it. Just because you have the image files, you have the jQuery file, you have the CSS file and um, in the additional images that you'll be creating. So everything should go in here. And I want you to hit upload files. And then you can do this a couple different ways. I'm going to go ahead and click on choose our files. And I'm just going to go ahead and select the file. So yours would be all the files that you have, the images and everything else. Hit open. going to upload in the commit changes and add it files for assignment submission commit changes hit refresh and see what this does what? hit pause while I figure this out Hit play because I'm back and okay, so I still got the jQuery. It did not upload the file. So let's try this again. Upload, please. There we go. Choose your files. Do this again. So yours would be at least these three files and then you would hopefully have another folder that says image and and all the images files and all of that stuff so yours will probably have i don't know maybe six or seven um so go ahead and select them all edit files for assignment submission commit changes and cross your fingers and see if this works Bum, 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 bum. It's processing, it's the thinking. Okay, so if I look in here, I see jQuery assignment. Let's make sure that the files are actually in there. It looks like I added files for assignment submissions or in my last comments. So we should be good on that. It's 20 sec one seconds ago is when it was updated. So everything should be good, and it is. So what I want you to submit is, let me go back into here. And yeah, OK, that was fine. So what I want you to submit is this URL right here whenever you're in jQuery assignment. So copy that and um, post that in Blackboard. Um, so let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.